Hello and welcome back to New Year New Game. This is where I play 365 games in my Steam library that I have never played before. And this is game 91, Grand Theft Auto 6. And I mean 91 games, and we get to play an early alpha of Grand Theft Auto 6. How great is that, you guys? Recording this in April. We're not recording in April recording it in March 31st, but when this comes out, it's going to be April 1st. And I'm going to be playing a early alpha of Grand Theft Auto 6, and you're all going to get to see it and watch me play it. How amazing is that? So good. Also April Fools. This says you're not going to see me play Grand Theft Auto 6. Don't click on those videos. I sure definitely didn't. Anyways, this is Nomad Survival. Nomad Survival is a survival game. Go figure by the title, right? It's kind of similar to Vampire Survivor. It's one of those constant waves of monsters where you have your adventurer in the center and you've got to take out these waves and waves of monsters and every time you level up, you get different abilities and can increase your abilities and the monsters get bigger and stronger and scarier and different things happen. You go around, you collect coins after you defeat monsters and crystals that'll level you up. Using the coins, you purchase different unlocks for the game, such as characters, things known as heritages, which give you different kind of abilities when you start the game, and even different levels that you can unlock as well, which we did. We managed to get to the second level, we managed to struggle, and I may have cried. Guess you'll just have to watch the video to find out if that's true or not. Anyways, I hope you all enjoy Nomad Survival, here, on New Year New Game. Oh, we shouldn't have any unlocks, so I don't need to look at anything else. Let's start the game. We had Adventurer, Crusader, and Cultist. Start off with a Adventurer. Base weapon skill, Horizontal Slash. Attack with a horizontal slash in front of where you're facing. There was a chance to fire a blade echo with your weapon skill. Blade echo is a projectile that fires out where you're facing only left or right. Ugh. Piercing enemies and doing damage equal to horizontal slash. Blade echo is not affected by a bounce. Weapon skill of all is level 30 and level 60. Alright. So we got, we don't have any of these heritages, so we're just, toward nomad. Plus one bonus rerolls every level. Here we go. Ah, uh, normal mode. Just play, play as is. We got our little cat pet. Okay, so the slashing is automatic. It's on the other left and right. That hurts. The cat attacks the rats. That's cool. Alright. Good for the gods. 25% uh, pickup range. Throw a projectile at a random enemy, which then balances. Occasionally increase your stats for a period of time. Negate incoming attack before briefly at vulnerable. Let's do this one. Look at that thing. I wish I had more than just two angles to shoot an attack. More slime balls now. Just go right through all of them. There we go. Uh, plus three HP regain per second. 
definitely should probably get another attack, but uh, I'll take some HP regain. Here we go. We're almost supposed to fireball towards the nearest enemy. I'll take that. Everything just automatically does it for me too, so that is wonderful. I don't have to press a bunch of buttons. I'm just gonna automatically hurl the fireballs. Gotta get around all this, all this craziness. Ooh, ooh, that hurt. Don't worry, we're gonna we get that back. We're gonna be okay. Just gonna kite the mobs around. Just gonna pick these up. Um, cats around there doing more damage than I am. Fire seven projectiles towards the nearest enemy. 1% uh, instant kill chance. 3% knockback. More HP. Let's get some more attacks going. We need some more attacks. No mini map, right? All right? This one's a darker color. That kind of hurt a bit. All right. Uh, passive miniaturize. We get an in invasion. Our size reduces. Uh, should we get more damage? Oh yeah, he ain't touching me. I'm too fast. Look at that echo just sweep through. Try not to get a bunch of a level of confidence about me. Alright. 5% chance to use... Lay enemies to explode on death. Damage all nearby enemies. That seems great. Throw a massive sword in the direction you're facing, which pierces all enemies. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do it in the direction I'm facing. Because I'm usually facing away from everyone. Projectile speed increase. Yeah, that's... Doing pretty good controlling them. Controlling the angry mobs. It's a little red bat. It's a new enemy type. Get back. Get back. There we go. Occasionally increase your stats for a period of time. Plus five defense, amount of modified. More HP, more damage. Uh, summon a roaming weapon that fires piercing projectiles. Let's increase our damage again. Be all beefy damage adventure boy. That's who we are. See that big old explosion over there? Uh, I can increase my movement speed. Conjuring a rotating orb, which moves in and out periodically, doesn't knock back. Plus one defense. Conjure a massive circle. Enemies that walk in, 200 damage, and amount unmodified. Let's do that one. Yeah, let's walk into my magic circle. Crystallized chest has appeared. Let's go to that crystallized chest.
coin. Wanted to get the coin. Yes, come to my circle. Come here. Go away from me now. Don't don't get near me anymore. Change my mind. Just all these crystals being left. Probably could have held on to that one. 30% knockback, we got more movement speed, prevent a random enemy from moving or shooting projectiles, amount unmodified. Um, more projectile speed, I think more movement speed. Which is going to be a little faster, because our enemies are getting kind of faster. I did not silence my notifications on my phone. Oh, I gotta actually break this thing, okay. Did not realize that. Oh, missing out on things. Missing out on things. Look at that guy! That's right, get hurt by my circle. There's a red one! Get hurt by my circle. Oh my goodness! Uh, more... HP regain. Negate incoming attack. Become briefly invulnerable. Summon a weapon which mimics your base weapon skill but with half damage. It's not good. Conjure a rotating orb which moves in and out periodically. Doesn't knock back. Mm. More regain. Yes, enjoy my magic circle. Ooh. Oh, Survivor Games. Here we go. Uh, lose size, get invasion. Wave of powerful energy sweeps the area, damaging enemies. Ooh, more missiles for magic missile. Let's get some sweeping stuff going on. There it goes. Oh, what is that thing? Uh, increase the chance of explosion. Let's do critical damage. Ow, stop doing that. No. 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 That's right, enjoy my circle. Ooh, uh, forgot that was mine. This uh, crystal chest is... Not wanting to break very easily. So there must be something good inside of it. You come on, come on, go in the circle. Get in the circle. Be a bunch of circle jerks. Better, better. This is gonna hurt. Oh, these are all hurting. A dark shroud approaches. I don't like that. Oh my gosh! <laughs> no! <laughs> Go away from me! A dark shrouded meanies. Take that. Uh, plus 10% duration. I don't know what that means. Increase your stats. Uh, plus one pickup range. Uh, plus 10% skill size. Let's do that. Let's increase the size of my skills. Yep. Just want to break this chest, man. I'm just trying to break a chest. You guys are just making it very difficult for me to break a chest. Yeek.
Uh, purifying Circle gets a one second more duration. A Meta Piercing Ray, which slowly rotates before disappearing. Uh, more magic missiles. More magic missiles! Oh no, what's that sound? Why are they doing that sound? Oh no. Oh, this was the darkness they were talking about. I was sorely mistaken in what I thought that darkness was. Ooh. There's a big old line of them. Oh no! This is not good, this hurts! Oh. I got to a big circle of them. We lost. Here lies Jackie, the adventurer. A weak, wanting, yet brave soul. Uh, let's play again? Of course we're gonna play again. Oh no, I don't want to play as the same character though. But which the game. We're going to do a different one. Uh, upgrades. Because now we have coins. And with these coins, we can buy things. It's usually how the videos of the games like this that I have seen work. And with the amount of coins we have, we can buy... Nothing. So let's, uh, let's return our title. Unlocks. Nothing. All right. Let's go ahead and start the game. This time we'll play the Crusader. More SP. Uh, his Holy Ore inflicts damage upon nearby enemies. Once a second, base damage for the skill is reduced by 50% every time uh, my weapon skill is used. Attack enemies in additional times with base damage, which isn't reduced. And then it evolves. Normal mode. Play, no modifiers. Attack the rats. Bring it on, rats. I just take you out with a beat. That's all I do. Alright. Uh, Ice Cool Barrage. Launch a series of projectiles in the direction you're facing. I don't like that it's when I'm facing. 5% uh, chance for slain enemies to explode on death. Don't really need that so much now. More experience. Let's do more experience. Oh, it takes out the bosses too. I didn't want to do that. Come on, come on, come on. I could still take you all out with this. A lightning bolt drops on a random enemy inflicting damage. I do like that. I already look like Thor. Having lightning just seems like a good thing. Summon a weapon which mimics your base weapon skill. Half the damage. Yeah, sure. Spectral sword. That's got an aura just like the other one. Let's do it. Two waves of just death circle. Two waves of death circle. Um. More damage for our spectral weapon. away slimes they don't die in one shot the rats still do though uh hurl explosive fireball towards the nearest enemy conjure massive circle enemies walk into it let's just do that we're just gonna be all circles we're just the circle master we're the master of circling Rats are dying now, too, so... Still dying, I should say. Slimes don't. Gotta watch out for those guys. Uh, critical damage? Let's do it. Yeah. Hey, you wanna come into my circles? You wanna come into my circles? You don't want my circles? Get out of here, rats, with my circles. Eh, eh, slime. There we go. Big circles. Slimes don't like the big circles. Uh, negate incoming enemy attack. Coming briefly. Invulnerable. Sounds wonderful. 30% uh, knockback, though. 
if I can knock back some of these slimes before they really hurt me. I'd be all for it. Bunch of rats, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, rats. Let's go, rats, I'm still one shot in you, so let's go. You want, you want to be tough guy? You want to be tough rat? You want to be tough rat? Let's go, you're gerbils. You're all gerbils. Uh, one more second duration of it lasting longer. Let's do that. That's, that sounds fun. Ah, uh, slimes don't die in one. Uh, another increased 30% knockback? Let's do it. They can stay out of my circles is what they can do. Achievement unlocked pest control. Uh, more experience. Blur projectile at a random enemy, which bounces a random direction two times. Uh, more damage. Let's do more damage. We need to start taking out slimes one shot. There we go. Still not one shot in slimes, but you know we're getting pretty close. Plus three SP regain per tick frame. Projectile speed, duration, smooth piercing rate slowly rotates before disappearing. Uh, let's do that. Let's get another attack out. Ah, ah, those guys hurt. I would love health regain. Health regain would be just lovely. Thought I saw a face or something up here. Yeah, here we are. Ah, just healed that. Oh, it comes a big one. Oversized rats. Uh, kinda think that movement speed would be great. I can move faster with my circles. Pick up things quicker, hopefully. Oh, bats do not die in one shot. Going right for the rats. Uh, more damage. More damage, more good. Try and kill more things in one shot. Crystallized chest has appeared. Let's go get that crystallized chest. Maybe we'll have better luck with this guy getting the crystal chest than we did with our adventure. We're already having better luck killing the uh, creatures. Because they were absolutely terrifying. <laughs> and we were constantly running. This one, I'm just like running towards them. Telling them, bring it on. Let's go, creature. Except for you. You go away. They only get harder the more time goes on. Wish I had something that like collected crystals for me. wonder if there is one of the pets that does that. Ow. Oh, there are more things. We're getting the little hooded men coming in, too. Um, 
more critical chance. More critical chance. Ooh, that hurts. That hurts so much. Uh, more critical. We are just not wanting to get any regeneration. One of those bats took a nibble out of me. Ah, another one did it too. Get closer to my magic death circle. But not that close. Uh, more damage. Ow. This is projectile fire. You dare fire your projectile upon me? You really... Could, uh... Some heals. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. They are just everywhere. I'm invulnerable. Achievement unlocked, golem got him. We got the golem guy. Nice. Ooh, we can open a chest. What do we get? We get relic one. Uh, base damage plus one speed doubles. Or rotation speed doubles. More damage, of course. Select an invocation. Destiny... Which, initial level, you'll start at 0 XP for the next level. Oh, instantly level up. Um, gain 10 rerolls, you don't have to use them immediately. Recover your HP to full, become immune to damage for 10 seconds. Yes! Set! We need that. Oh, you go away! Uh, movement speed, let me get out of here. <laughs> Little... A little quick, please. Oh no, we're not killing rats in one hit anymore. The rats have gotten stronger. Plus zero amount skill instance. Next level grant plus one amount. Here we are. Health regain. That's what I was looking for. Let's do it. I could reroll, but I feel like that's cheating. Give me what I got. We'll just, we'll make do. We will make do with it. Uh, I can do max HP. We can get even more health regain. I would like more health regain. Because these guys hit pretty hard. I would really like to open this chest, though. Oh no, the music's going away. Oh, the darkness is approaching. Oh, those things are there. Oh my goodness, they are all around me. Get out of here. Darkness imprisoning me. Um, I think we're just gonna have to use this infernal ray a little more. Yes, come closer to my deadly circles. Um, emit a percent aura, which damages all enemies that enter it. Doesn't knock back.
Really want this crystal chest open. Would really like that. Oh, flowers. Evil flowers. We need to open the crystal chest. We got it. Damage enemy, which bounces to two others. Skill amounts modifier. Uh, negate coming attack. Get this level two. Become briefly invulnerable. I like that. Uh, we got another gift from the gods. Oh, thank you. So wonderful gods. Summon a roaming weapon that fires piercing projectiles. Uh, five percent critical chance. Sounds fun. Here we go. Chest. Open the chest. Uh, we can get relic one. Which is energy wave size double. Or lightning strike, but it's for its chance to drop a big bolt. That sounds so much fun. Destiny. Level, we get rerolls, we get full HP. We're pretty good on HP, so let's instantly level. Uh, let's get even more damage. Because more damage, more good. Uh, let's start heading over towards the other crystal chest. Stop with the circles. Get out of here. Get, get going. Get just go running through ya. Just running through ya. The hat person got vaporized. Yes, get closer to my circle. Get closer to my circles. We are just all circles. Nothing but circles here. <laughs> I just got like this big ol' beam that comes up and uh, just annihilates <laughs> somebody. The darkness begins to fade. It's a good thing. So I mean, the music will change to something more happy. Yes. Come at me. Oh, we can get our purifying circle up. Um, how about we do this? Passive curse. Five percent chance that enemies explode. You get into my circle and then you explode. Oh, they're everywhere. I see all this damage going over on the right side. Oh, that was a good one. <laughs> oh, no. That was a big bolt. Now just come into my circle. Come into my circle. Oh, this is so much. There are so many of them. <laughs> the slimes are back and they're stronger. And the slimier. Cliff again. Skill size plus 15%. More damage. More damage we're getting. More damage. We need that. Um, is there a massive sword? No. You ain't coming damage. I might do that again. Get that up higher. Oh, wow. We leveled up so many times. Uh, psychic control might not be such a bad thing. Picking up things a little closer to us. We're getting more experience. Oh, now we get to choose our path here. Divine Aura. 
and then they're smite. Uh, Holy Oler now allows you to inflict 100% base damage upon enemies every time your weapon skill is used. The additional attack has a 3x base damage. Let's do that. Because that also means my little specter weapon increases. Um, I wish I would increase my aura. I don't know if it does or not. But increasing the size of my attack would be ideal. More bigger circles. Look at that thing! There's a green news guy over there. Who's doing things. I don't know what he's really doing. But it can't be good. Got like bouncy, bouncy oops coming out. Ow, oh, that hurts. Oh my goodness! Must level. It's coming towards the big hurt circle. Um, Spectral Sword gets plus 3 SP regain per tick and frame. Let's do that. Whatever that does. Oh, we got something. What can we roll? Oh, no. Oh, this is hurting me. Oh, no healths from those. Oh, we made a mistake. Let's go. I think we got temporary invulnerability to get through all that. <clears throat> Give me this. Yes. Uh, damage enemy which bounces. I think that's the one that we're gonna be doing. Chain lightning. Chat. <laughs> we are channeling our inner Hemsworth. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Oh my goodness! <laughs> I was <almost> just died. <laughs> oh no, the flies! Oh goodness. More critical damage. Or more critical chance. Uh, has a heart. They're good at. Alright. Makes me worry a slightly less. Still very worried. Oh my god! <laughs> so many! <laughs> so many flies and oozes! We missed that one. Stay back, you heathens! Yes, hit the. Get the hurt circle. Ah. Uh, I feel like I should definitely be doing the pickup range. There's foxes here now. Oh, foxes! Get out of here, foxes! Enter my hurt circle. Oh, they're hurting me. by entering my heart circle. Oh. Oh, the irony. Gotta get that big, goofy boss. Uh, more movement speed. Hardly notice a difference in that one. Yeah, 
this into the ouch. Oh, should I just do more health since my health seems to be going down? A lot of series of projectiles in the direction you're facing. No. Let me from moving or shooting projectiles. Let's do that. Boxes now have shields and spears. This out circle is for you. that one it might have hit me there we go uh, I feel like it really should get some more health regain just because they are getting in there some of them are getting their licks in oh oh like that guy Still have yet to take out that big slime face guy. Break! Break! Curse you! Break! <laughs> oh good, it's like right in that little hurt circle. Ah! There we go. Minus 10 percent attack delay. Oh, for the Inferno Ray. Uh, more damage. Plus one base damage for Spectral Sword, though. Spectral Sword, you get more damage. Oh no, a Dark Shroud approaching. That guy's dead. He's gonna die. He died. Let's get that chest. Sticky Icky achievement unlocked. That's a good one. Uh, spectral bow, I don't really want that, but relic two is leave behind something. Cast an unmodified skill from the slain boss. High school barrage, size double. Let's do that. Um Destiny, we'll just level up. Girl expose a fireball towards the nearest enemy. Let's do this. Oh, oh, no. oh. Achievement unlocked, whirlwind of goo. Is that my whirlwind of goo? I think it is. I think it is. Yes, good man. Oh, I still need to go get that crystal chest. Let's go break that crystal chest. It's got to be given away here soon, right? Right? Uh, more knockback. And more critical chance. Let's do more critical chance. I think one is critical damage, and then the other one is critical chance. Oh, this guy. I see danger points on the map. Just gonna avoid those. Just gonna do our best to avoid the danger points. We slayed them. Isn't that lovely? Uh, open the chest. Base damage plus 2, size plus 50%. Uh, cast an unmodifiable skill from the slain boss. Let's do this one. Let's give our destiny uh, more damage. Oh! 
Open you crystal chest, curse you! Yes, yes, come to the hurt. Oh, oh no. Oh no you don't. There we go, we did it. Open it up, what are we getting? Uh, rotation speed doubled. Fireball and explosion sized up. Let's do that. Destiny again. Uh, cause all enemies to wander away. Ineffective on boss enemies. 5% chance. Nope, we want them to explode. Let's go towards another crystal chest. It's like a platinum coin. Yes, Fox, you get the hurt. You get the hurt. And then we can go between these two crystal chests. Ah, oh no, that hurt. Darkness begins to fade. Oh no! Yeah. They were just all around. There was no getting around them. Whoo! Top five skills though Spectral Sword, Infernal Ray, Purifying Circle. Look at all the damage we were doing. This was great. Let's go return to the Titan. Here lies Carmel, the Crusader. They will quickly be forgotten. Yeah. We got new unlocks. We unlocked a character. We got the Ratfolk Archer. Unlock, uh, Heritage. Unlock. Oh, Berserker Heritage. By defeating the bosses, we get Heritages that we can unlock. Unlock Heritage. Poxbringer. Defeat the Giant Slime. Unlock Level the Crossroads by defeating the Giant Golem. Uh, we have 1,300 that we can spend. So maybe we get... So I still have one base character to use. I say we get the new level. And we unlock the Berserker Heritage. Hooray! And then we go back. And I, I see, you say new unlocks, but... There's not. Let me check these pets real quick. Any of you guys have increased damage dealt? Uh, trait effective player the most high full time. You have this pet's not selected. Movement speed. And evasion. Any of you guys pick things up? Damage dealt to enemies for specific pets. Uh, skill size plus 2%. Critical chance plus 1. Uh, pet damage. Coin bonus plus 2%. Pickup range plus 3%. percent it has got a pickup range. Uh, max HP and defense. Let's do the raccoon. Start game. We're gonna use the cultist this time. 200 SP regains over time. Weapon skill is used when at max SP. Base weapon skill, blood curse. Curse a random enemy, causing him to explode and die instantly. Damaging nearby enemies, amount unmodifiable, which means the amount stat will not increase the number of targets. Very nice. Uh, we can do a berserker nomad. We inflict double damage, but lost HP cannot be recovered in any way whatsoever. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Reject weakness. Pain means you're alive. Let your agony and your suffering be fuel for the fire. Let's do it. Let's go. We're going hard on this one. And we're going to go to level two. We're going to not mess with any of these. I don't really know what they do. Yeah. Nine, 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 nine. So it just automatically kills a random enemy. It's cool. If you die, close. I dare you. Go ahead. Go ahead. Get close. Get 
get yourselves close. My raccoon's way over there for whatever reason. Oh, that hurts. And we can't heal. Oh, oh no. Yeah, let's not go that way. You. Ah. Hey, it's the end. Um. Definitely need a different. Let's do energy wave. can't get any healing. Oh! Okay, good. This works. This works for now on the weak enemies. playing this with just the lowest of health. Just give me all the attacks. so hard. The Berserk one is just no fun. Especially in a small level like that. Oh. New unlocks. Yeah, we didn't get very much. Let's go back. Let's go start again. Um, let's try the Cultist again. Let's not do the Berserker path. Uh, we'll go back here in normal mode. Maybe the trick is just to, like, stay in the crossroad. Raccoon, where are you going? Ow. Figured ideally you want them to be a little close to you to get the full explosion effect. Yeah, what are you doing? He just keeps running back and forth. Yeah, the cultist ability is, uh... <laughs> it's cool that it automatically kills a random enemy. It'd be even better if it was like an enemy. Wait, can I go in there? No. Okay. Ow! 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 
Uh, nothing for healing, though. Okay. Oh my goodness. Yep, yep, we're gonna die. Oh my gosh. Cultist is a hard one. Return to title. Um, I don't think we got any coins to do anything. Let's I'll start up another game. This time, let's just go back to the adventurer. Uh, let's do regular nomad adventurer on this level. It's got extra difficulty, but because there are really only left and right to look from, it'll be easier. Achievement unlocked: Dawn of the Dead. Oof, oof. Oh, okay. So much for easier. Gonna need that, thank you. Yep, 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 that all hurt. Ow, ow, ow. Oh my god, it's so hard. <laughs> uh, achievement unlocked. You did this on purpose. I don't know if the achievements really unlocked anything. We got this new character, Necromancer, for slaying a thousand zombies. It didn't even seem like we slayed a thousand zombies. Uh, it doesn't look like we got anything else. Go back. Start again. This time we'll do our Crusader. Should we do the Berserker Crusader, though? Make it a little difficult, since he was pretty easy. And he's got this ability, too, which I think is going to be just fantastic in this location. Matter of fact, I'm just going to go stand in the center of the crossroads. And just let them all come to me and die. Let's do that. Spectral sword again, here we go. Double ouch, double the ouch. So I can pick these up quicker. Maybe level up a little faster. Got four minutes left. I would like to see what a new character does. Increase my size, but get more evasion. And more damage. Duplication, plus zero amount, skill instance, next level grant a plus one amount, bonus instead of zero. Let's do a defense. I'm curious about this miniaturized. More evasion. Spectral Sword gets a plus one base damage. <laughs> I 
No, we didn't do that one. Hmm. Ooh, ow. Give me that. Uh, lightning strikes. Expansion, skill size increase. Yeah, give us a little breathing room from time to time, we'll need it. Purifying circle. Doesn't <laughs> this gotta be so crazy? Uh, let's do that. Pick some of these things up. Purifying circle lasts longer. damage. More negation. If I stay like near my spectral sword too, it's just like double the damage. Skill size increase. That's for the one other aura that's like within my aura. <laughs> and there goes the timer. That's an hour. It's all gonna be like extra overtime stuff here. Uh, there we go, more skill size. Increase my skill size, please do. Make my aura bigger, I don't mind. down on the circle. Uh, spectral sword will start ticking. A portal has appeared. Destroy it. Oh, it's down here. So we gotta go destroy that portal then. More damage. Yep, that hurts. Those are hurting. Oh, the portal moves. Oh, stop. Get off me. There we go. Uh, we can't heal, unfortunately. Uh, mimics your first weapon skill evolution if it's cool. So, since we can't do life... Can we, though? I don't think we can. It said no. 
Uh, should I increase pickup range? Let's increase pickup range. Oh, those things explode. They don't die in one hit. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna have to stay wherever my spectral blade goes. Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh no! I think we're coming near the end. Should I increase this one? Might as well. Oh, what is this? What is this? What is happening right now? Oh, it's this person's doing, isn't it? Uh, base damage to my Spectral Sword, still continue with the Divine Aura. Ah, oh, they got me. I was like one shot away, so... Makes sense. Here lies Alex, the Crusader. They lost. Yeah. Well... For a Berserker run, that wasn't too, too bad. Did we get some more unlocks? We could get another Heritage with Poxbringer. Um, looking around, because we did get some achievements. Nah. We can get Rat Folk Archer, which I will, and the Heritage Poxbringer. But yeah, that's it. That is Nomad Survival. I'm just going to do this. A wonderful survival game and a... Uh, Humble Bundle Bundle <laughs> just came out. That is a survival bundle. So it's games like Nomad Survival that play just kind of similar to how this game plays. Just like, uh, what's the other game that was more popular for it? Can't think of it. Was it Vampire Survivor or something like that? It was almost like a Castlevania type game. But it's essentially just this. You have your adventurer. You had waves and waves and waves of monsters. And you have to destroy them. And you level up. And you get different abilities. And you level up your abilities. And the monsters get stronger and bigger. And ah, ah. <laughs> just all of that. Which is a lovely, fun genre. And there are a ton of games out there that play just like this one. Uh, you can pick up that Humble Bundle bundle, though, that has Nomad Survival. I'll include a link in the description below. And if you click on that link and you purchase that bundle, I get a little bit back to my Humble Bundle wallet, which I use to purchase more games, because more games is more good. Anyways, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next game. Goodbye.